Welcome to Yoga with Adrian. I'm Adrian and this is Benji. And today we have a beautiful meditation for mental balance and grounding. So grab something to sit on if you like, hop into something extra comfy, and let's get started. All right, welcome my darling friends. We're going to begin, surprise, our practice today in a comfortable seat. So take your time, just notice if you're kind of rushing right now here and let's start to slow it down as you come into a nice cross-legged seat. And I will encourage you, particularly if you're new to sitting <laughs> in a meditation, uh, to lift your hips up either on a couch pillow or if you have a bolster, great. You can fold up some blankets or some towels or just fine too. And get to where your hips are a little bit higher than your knees so you can create these two little slides uh, of the thighs down. And as you start to get settled in here, just start to tap into that inner smile as much as you're willing. Uh, this is my power tool, my secret weapon that I often talk about, so it's not so secret. But just as you settle in, you can start to kind of feel the benefits of this time that you're taking for yourself by softening and, yeah, tapping into that inner smile. It can be like, I'm doing this, or, oh my God, I need this. Whatever it is, just tap into a little joy that you're taking this short but valuable time for yourself. Benji's relaxed. If you're not relaxed, we'll get you there or we'll try. Hopefully by now you're in your seat, getting settled in. And if you are working with your back right now, I'll say that, feel free to sit up against a wall or you can even do this in a chair. You just wanna make sure that your spine is nice and long. And on that note, let's take a moment here to gently tuck the chin and bring more awareness to the spine. So that could be sitting up tall. It could just be noticing your pattern. Again, just gently tucking the chin, feeling that length as you do so through the back of the neck. And best you can, can bringing more awareness to your spine. And if you haven't already, allow your hands to soften, fingertips to soften, just wherever feels good. And then as I often invite you to do in practice, same thing here, just notice what feels good today, whether you need a more grounding palm, right, energetically. I'm here, I'm doing this, I need to breathe, I need this. Time for myself. Or maybe you're feeling pretty good and this is more preventative care today. So open those palms up, baby. Allow yourself to be a little more vulnerable, open. So both are vulnerable. But you get to decide. And, and really, we're connecting the brain to the body here. So there's so much that goes into these little gestures and making decisions for yourself. If you know a mudra you want to take it now, please do. And then, if you haven't already, close your eyes. Allow your eyelids to get heavy here. And if, for whatever reason, you're not comfortable with the eyelids closed, just soften your gaze gently down past your nose. Alrighty, and we've begun. Chin slightly tucked. Neck long. Hands, arms carefully placed. Fingers soft. Let's start by noticing any sounds around us. Wherever you may be today. or maybe relishing silence. Mm -hmm. 
as we start to settle in and ground down, allow any extra movement, patterns, just fidgeting. See if you can allow them to soften as you build a little structure for your meditation here. In time, finding stillness with more ease and being kind if you're noticing a lot of fidgeting or patterns, no worries, that's why we're here. To observe with kindness. To welcome balance and clarity to both the mental and emotional self. Now most of you have already likely begun to notice your breath, but if not, allow me to roll out the red carpet to bring fresh picked flowers to your doorstep and welcome you to just notice with a loving kindness your natural breath. And as you begin to notice the rhythm of your natural breath today, see if you can take it one step further inviting the mind to also notice what the breath does to the body as you breathe in and out. Notice, if you can, what parts of the body move as you breathe in. And see if you can notice how gravity tends to take over as you breathe out. So we have this sense of a rise and a fall, nice and easy, nothing forced. Just noticing what moves as you breathe in and embracing the gravity as you breathe out. Now you can keep going just as is or I'll bring another fresh bouquet to your door and invite you to deepen the breath just a bit. Bringing more consciousness, <clears throat> more loving awareness to that inhale and watching the ripple effect as you breathe in. And using that exhale to ground down, relax the shoulders, relax your jaw. Allowing your inhale perhaps to be a little deeper, more full. And perhaps when you're ready, allowing your exhale to be longer. Think of it as a beautiful extension. Breathing out as you ground down, down, down. Now go ahead and let your nice, conscious, deep breaths rest. 
return to just a nice, easy, natural rhythm and flow. With so much love and a gentle, just gentleness, see if you can reestablish this awareness in your spine by maybe lifting your heart gently, sitting up a little bit taller. And you might feel if you're doing this with your eyes closed as though you grow a little bit longer and taller in the spine. And as you rest easy here in your seat, soften the skin of the forehead, relax the jaw, and again, use a gentle exhale to relax the shoulders down. You're more than halfway through your meditation. So as thoughts come to your mind, to your soul, just acknowledge them and come right back to the loving awareness of your breath. So beginning to deepen the breath a little bit. Again here, see if you can find something new as you breathe in. Embracing gravity as you breathe out. as you continue to breathe and lean into the dance of feeling the inhale lift you, the rise, and feeling the exhale ground you, the fall of the breath, as you lean into that balance of the two. I lovingly invite you to just bring your mind's eye to the tip top crown of your head. Place your attention there. And then imagine head over heart, heart over pelvis, and from the crown tip top of your head, in your own way, whatever this means to you, draw a line from the top of your head down through the center core channel of your being all the way to the base of the spine. So we've placed a light rope or pipeline, a cylinder, whatever it is for you, this awareness from the crown of the head to the base of the spine. And see if you can allow that action, that awareness, affect your breath or to at least notice if it changed the way you're holding yourself up here with each inhale and the way you're using your exhale to continuously ground down. And for the last minute here, we'll take that line from the crown to the base of the spine. And just hang with me, my friends. Continue that line down, past your physical body, down into the earth. Continue that line down into the core of the earth. And then notice how that makes you feel. Notice if, and it may not, if that affects the way you carry yourself here, the way you breathe in, and the way you breathe out.
Now take three final conscious breaths. Finding balance and a sense of calm or peace between the dance of the rise and the fall, the lift and the ground. The earth and the sky. Then release your conscious breaths. Rest easy here as you slowly drop your chin to your chest. Try to keep the shoulders relaxed here as you gently open your eyes. You can flutter the eyelashes open. And when you're ready, gently lift your head. Cue the birds outside my window. We'll bring the palms together. Just take one quiet little beat here to notice how you feel. And we'll close it off by bowing together and whispering, Namaste.